Good morning. It's December 13th. It's time for the Blue Water by Curate Schools video of the day. It's Deacon John here. Those are the Bostic boys playing their violins for its National Violin Day. It's also National Ice Cream Day. And now for this day in history. This day in history. December 13th. In 1642, New Zealand was discovered by a Westerner for the first time. Dutch navigator Abel Tasman. In 1918, President Woodrow Wilson arrived in France. He was the first U.S. president to visit Europe while in office. In 1978, the Susan B. Anthony dollar went into circulation, the first U.S. coin to honor a woman. And on this day in 2000, Al Gore threw in the towel in the presidential election. Although the sitting vice president won the popular vote, a close race in Florida led to more than a month of legal wrangling and hanging chads. Finally, after 38 days, the Supreme Court put a stop to the recount, Gore conceded, and George W. Bush became president-elect. And that's this in history. is St. Lucy, and Lucy was an amazing saint. At just a young age, her graces began. She died, Her father died when she was an infant, and her mother pressured her into an arranged marriage, but she said no, she wanted to, become, she wanted to remain chaste. After this, her mother grew ill, so Lucy convinced her mother to accompany her to pray to the tomb of St. Agnes. As a result, Lucy's mother was miraculously cured. Lucy then told her mother of her vow of chastity, and she gave herself over to serving persecuted Christians who were hiding in the catacombs, wearing a wreath of candles on her head to illumine the dark underground caverns with her arms full of provisions. Upon finding that Lucy was a Christian and had refused his hand in marriage, the man to whom she was betrothed had her imprisoned under the persecutions of the emperor, of the Roman emperor. She was then to be put to death, and they tried to set her on fire, but the wood underneath Lucy would not burn. Finally, she was killed by a sword. We asked for St. Lucy, one of the great martyrs of the church, to pray for us today. Our verse of the day, the thief comes only to steal and kill and destroy. I came that they may have life and have it abundantly. So Jesus is only looking out for, and God is only looking out for, the good things in our life. And what's the joke today? Well, it is. Why was Santa himself sad? Because he had low self-esteem. And now on to some videotape of Kyle Mayaki, who had an amazing day at the gym this weekend. Everybody have a great day. To end today's video, I know we have many great athletes in the Blue Water by Carrot Schools, but uh, this is really a good feat from this weekend as we watch Kyle Mayaki from Holy Cross perform some gymnastics on the rings. Mm -hmm.